how to make a wave effect using envelope deformation in Inkscape. Using the text tool, drag and drop, create a text box and type out your phrase. From the text menus above, select your font, change your size, alignment, and spacing as needed. Because it's just text, we need to convert it to an object by going path and object to path and object ungroup to ungroup all the isolated letters. Path and union to weld each row together. Then go path, path effects, and that opens up the path effects menu on the right hand side. Selecting the plus button, you'll see the path effects options and you can select envelope deformation from the menu. Envelope deformation is going to allow you to add multiple bends to your entire layer. So you can add a bend at the top, the bottom, the left, or the right. And this allows you to manipulate each point. This is different from the bend path in my previous video because that bend effect only allows one segment straight down the middle. So you can only apply curves and waves to the entire layer as a whole, whereas this envelope deformation allows you to bend from the top or the bottom or the left or the right or all of the above, as well as add curvature. So you're going to be able to change the perspective of this dimension. Because it allows that you're able to go and warp your image versus curve your image, thus allowing this wave of a smaller to larger appearance. Because it is an appearance, it is only an effect and it can be hidden by selecting the eye and hiding that effect and it won't translate to design space. So you need to convert it to an object by selecting path and object to path. Once you do that, it converts it to a file. You're going to upload that SVG file into Design Space, and you'll see that that path effect stood. So I did show you one where I didn't save the path effect, and you see that it's still just as a regular image. So I'm going to hide those, and I'm left with just my final design.